individuality. I really wanted to <laughs> talk about individuality from the point of human design system. So my definitions, even though they are both black and red together, are purely individual and integration. Which is extreme individual. <laughs> you know, it's just my own survival and individual. It's like, okay, um, I operate as myself and there's nobody else that I can rely on because that's the point. I need to figure shit out for myself. Also means that I don't fucking listen to anybody, no matter how good the advice is, no matter how right they are. It doesn't matter. It's just, <sighs> I just don't hear it. And yes, fifty-seven ten is integration, but it is very acoustic, I guess. Twenty-three forty-three as well which is an individual channel and pff, ah, exactly who, when, where, what I need to, you know, assign that to, I don't know, but <laughs> it's funny because I got to talk about this to a good friend of mine and she also mentioned how sometimes she couldn't, couldn't, cannot listen to people, not listen to people's words when they're speaking, but instead just focuses on the melody I would say I focus on frequency. So I don't care about the melody. I don't care definitely not about words. But I just kind of swim with them wherever we are when we talk. And I notice the melody being this way that way and the rhythm being slower or faster and the volume being louder or really quiet really really quiet but i just am <sighs> noticing sensations in my body and how when i talk to people who are operating through this really pure clean frequency right just life force i guess makes me want to stretch it's almost like <sighs> if i need to, if i want to take this in i need to really relax my body And then when I open my mouth, it's almost like, and it's not even opening my mouth, it's almost like I lose all control over how I move, over how I behave, over the way I laugh, over my facial expressions, over, yeah, at the end, what words come out. And I can't believe I'm saying things that I'm saying, and I get lost in the interactions so much that I just don't notice what's going on and that's so incredible I'm not sure if I'm really talking about individuality at all but I mean the part of me being completely deaf and not hearing anything yes but I also wouldn't say that's true I mean I don't know any other way obviously but just I hear so much it's just, I don't really care about words. I don't think they're important anyway. I don't understand why they would be when we communicate in so many different ways. And 
words are just the tiniest part of how we speak and communicate with each other. It almost makes me sad that we've limited ourselves to only following words. When you could just spend the whole conversation focusing on someone's breath and only listening to that. When you could just focus on the way the wrinkles move around their eyes when they speak. When you can focus on the temperature of their body almost changing. When you could even notice the sharpness of their voice. Is it very airy? Is it extremely full? and straight, and focused. Is it high? <laughs> or is it very low? <laughs> Do they speak slow? Are they trying to speak in a specific way? Or is it just supernatural for them? Are they honest? Are they lying? Hmm. And then, yeah, then I guess, um, what are the words that they're saying? <laughs> <laughs> 